Okay, greetings, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play from a brand new Let's Player. Me. Um, I've never recorded anything. Ever. Well, I've done some live streams, but like, it, all it amounts to is screen sharing on Skype, so I mean. Anyway, you don't care about that. Welcome to a Let's Play of Silent Hill 2, Director's Cut. Um... Subtitles are on. Language is English. If the menus were not terrible at speed, then you would have seen that before you heard it. Anyway, I'm going to be playing on normal difficulty with normal riddles. Uh, I've done a little bit of testing, so I know a little bit of what happens. Um, yeah, there have been issues with bugs, with uh, sound looping, but hopefully I just fix that. We'll see. This is going to be kind of short, like 10, 15 minutes maybe, um, just to get a grip on, you know, things. So yeah, let's start a new game. Normal, normal. I'm also a little bit sick, so I apologize if I cough or something. I'm gonna try not to, to talk over cutscenes, but it's gonna happen, so, you know, deal with it. Watch the Let's Play for the commentary. Don't complain. <sighs> Why? Why does he make that noise? It's, uh, not a normal noise people make when they s stand in gritty bathrooms and sigh into mirrors while they touch their faces. Really enthralled with urinals, apparently. Look at that, it's like half the shot. Someone Mary, just spent a lot of time rendering that urinal. Could you really, really be bad. in this town? Sorry, I'm talking already. You can read, get over it. At least I hope you can read. If you can't read, you probably are not old enough to be on YouTube without parental consent, so. dreams. I see that town. Please don't. Silent go. Hill. Why would you leave your card You open? promised you'd take me there again someday. I never even noticed that. But you never did. Well, I'm alone there now. In our special place. Waiting for you. Acoustic. The name on the envelope said Mary. This music just doesn't fit with the tone of the rest of the game. My wife's name. Just at all. It's ridiculous. Couldn't possibly be true. Look at the picture they made as the background. That's what I keep telling myself. That's so great. A dead person can't write a letter. Mary died of that damn disease three years ago. So then, why am I looking for her? Our special place. What could she mean? This whole town was our special place. Does she mean the park on the lake? We spent the whole day there. Just the two of us, staring at the water. Sounds so fucking boring. Could Mary really be there? Is she really alive? Waiting for me? We're just angsty teens and adult bodies. Also, I want you to note that there's like next to no fog on this, this uh, lovely backdrop that they've put up in place of background. And see, that's my theory. They're hiding all the Satanism behind this really elaborate backdrop. Because 
that's clearly not. That's 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 a photo. There's also no fog, which is like a main feature of the town when you get there. Uh, all the oh, I can go back in the bathroom. That's so cool. I didn't think I could do that. Ooh. Pretty nifty. Um, yeah, I don't remember if I mentioned or not. I probably did. I'm probably repeating myself, but. I know nothing about this game. I've played a little bit. Um, obviously it's tested. But I don't know jack shit about this game beyond that. So all scares will be genuine. And I'm a pretty terrified person in general, so, you know, there'll be lots of them. Look forward to it. Uh, I don't, frankly, I don't even know when this game was made. I know it's old. Like 2000s, probably. Um, map. Yeah, take the damn map. I got a map of Silent Hill. <sighs> okay. We can leave now. He just leaves his car door open. Ugh. I mean, I know there's no one 